today, you are in for a treat. That's what we're here to look at, the history of vinyl records, and the so-called vinyl revival we are looking at today. In this case, we have to travel back to the year 1857. Yep, 1857. That's the year that the French inventor, Edouard Leon Scott de Montville, patented his device called the phonautograph. Sound fascinated Scott, and he obsessed over ways to capture it. What his invention allowed him to do was to collect sound waves through a horn attached to a diaphragm with a stylus. The result was a series of scribbles on paper. Think of the scribbles like a primitive way to way to way to never intended for these to be played back, but over 150 years later, they were. Scientists at the Lawrence Berkeley National Laboratory were able to convert these scribbles into a digital audio file. The results are somewhat chilling. The oldest recorded human voice ever singing the French song, Eau Claire de la Lune. Check this out. You'll have to listen carefully. Jump forward 20 years to July 18, 1877. This was the date that Thomas Edison and his team revealed his phonograph to the world. It wasn't like anything you've seen today. This recording and playback machine was manual, in the sense that you had to turn a crank, which turned a groove to a metal cylinder. The sounds were captured on a thin sheet of foil wrapped around the 